Alright, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Mickey. First ever walkthrough on this YouTube s society crap. Yep, okay, that was really bad, but you know who cares? We're doing this, Tears of the Borderlands, so why the fuck not? Never done a game like this before, so let's hope it goes good. Let's go. This is probably gonna go wrong in so many places. Commentary is gonna be bad. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Let's go. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora. We're told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people call them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. <laughs> He ran the corporation Hyperia, and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less. Ah, obvious rewards. Stories. Legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Thank you. Fiona! Come on, we can work this out! Fiona? What, is there some sort of radiation leak? I don't know about it. Wow. Exactly, are we going? I ask the questions. Okay, then, uh, do you mind asking yourself where you're taking me? <laughs> oh, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smart ass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh... From the beginning. Right. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the baddest guy of them all. It must feel good to find to be just like him. Take it, it's yours, right? I mean, you always said that. Everyone did. Gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but but hey, here we are. Which resulted in a company 
overflowing with assholes. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. Oh, I'm a you're best friend. A fraction of what he earns. You'll be rolling in it. I figure I could get lunch. Seems like a good place to start. Well, then we're starting with three of whatever's most expensive. Sure. And wine pairings. For lunch? We're gonna get twisted, bro. If I'm not puking up $500 in food and alcohol this afternoon, then we are doing it wrong. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Thanks for the help, Vaughn. Really. I couldn't have done this without you and Yvette. Hey, man, don't sweat it. Uh, I'm just happy we even got you here. You know, I crunched the numbers one night and figured out there was a 45% chance someone would kill you before this day. Glad that didn't happen. Wow. Me too. It was a uh, real touch and go there for a bit. A 45% chance I could have died before All this right, day? Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Um. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. There it is. I guess that's all you have to do to look like a Hyperion. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why. Okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So you might not have been in the loop. So where's Henderson? He uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. Hmm. It's destiny, Reese. And men. Real men. Men like me make their own and you can hold a grudge if you like no harm no foul your thoughts are your own but bad things can happen when you swim against fate sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny you don't want to be that man wow I could not have timed that better that really helps dramatically make which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. 
Of course I'm still interested. I guess I'm near a computer. Ten million. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Hmm. Just look at his computer, shall we? Uh, oh, wait. That's not happening. Yeah, 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 no, but. Three years sucking up to the guy. How do you want the money or not? Because I. Oof. Why do the biggest scumbags always have the best? It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get. That should be. Me. Only less Vasquezzi. Yes. Vasquezzi's the best I got. Wow. Alright, this guy. Yeah, that's what we had before. Oh shit. It's a working deal. Cars expensive, class high. She's a cutly pewin. Huh? An encrypted file. about before we were so rudely interrupted we were talking <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion all right your uh, promotion Anderson was a fool he didn't know his place he needed lesson number one humility but you I respect you Reese that's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. What? No. No, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. Better get an eye installed in the back of your head. Because you, you never know when... But I could be creeping up... Behind you. Wow, I just got sucker I'm punched. Your boss, Reese. Get used to that. This is what I'm talking about when I say humility. That was lesson number two. Don't make lesson number three about a number two. What? Don't make me crap on the floor and make you clean it up. You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. God dang, I got sucker punch pretty hard. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No. No, no, this can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. I'm about to kick this trash can. Fuck this. Sorry, you were saying something. I interrupted you. Reese? Why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap! 
So does that mean you're not buying? Well, just try and lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is his vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right? Hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. Well, things get dicey. Look. It's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now and when you get back. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clear up to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. This is gonna be one hell of a game. That guy get wrecked. Wow, I... What? What? Oh. <laughs> what do we even... What do we even hit? Why? Oh, I hope that wasn't like Why a really ugly person. Why would you cross right there? Oh, crap. I think we... I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. 
They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. See, it's fine. I think. So, what do we say if someone asks where we got the money? What do you mean? Well, I mean, what do we tell people? We should have a story. I, mean, I would prefer not to tell them that we stole it from Hyperion. That would not go over well. I just think we need a plan of some sort. We just tell them the truth, that we stole it. How is that a good idea? Hey, we're on Pandora. We'll actually get more street cred if it seems like we're bigger criminals than we are. Uh, okay, that makes sense. So, this looks not good. Got ourselves a hero here! What are you looking at? It's Pandora. What did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. Uh, I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have ten million dollars chained to me is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back planet nut jobs. I'm just getting a vibe, you know? Just keep your eyes open for the place, okay? I don't want to be here any longer than we have to. Yeah. And uh, watch the money. Oh, really? Listen, one tap on the arm, and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works, but it's definitely neat. Yeah, stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You, and me, Yvette. I mean, we bring this key back. And they're gonna make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it. Then it's kick back on the moon beach time. Yeah, yeah, we'll pop champagne and everything after we get back with the key. Ah, come on, it's in the bag. Nah, it's never gonna be in the bag. The tracker's beep, beep, beeping, but. I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? No. Could ask one of them. They seem normal ish. Normal ish enough, anyway. Well, you could ask one of them. You're the closer, right? So close. Get us some direction. Ah. Uh. I'm probably gonna regret doing this. That car is gonna get stolen. Alright! Let's do this. Alright. Fine. I had to use the restroom, but now I don't anymore. Yo, buddy, yo, pal. I don't know you, but let's get talk to you. <clears throat> Hi. Excuse me, uh, sir. Do you know where the uh, world of curiosities is? Uh. It should be around here. You lost. Um. What are you here for? It's just a simple business deal. A few papers to sign, and then we're out. Easy. Huh. Those the papers? Of a sort? You're Hyperion. You wake suckers ruin this town, you know that? Atlas were bastards, but at least they had the good sense to fail. When Jack came in, he turned everything to smoke. Oh my god. God, who called in the wambulance, huh? Look, if you don't know where the world of curiosities is, stop wasting our time and just tell us so we can move on to the next hole of garbage that you people call a suburb and see if their morons know any better. You know, I thought today was gonna be boring. Hey, little man. What's in the case? Hey, kitty cat. Show us what's in the case. Okay, now, look, before we get all bent, uh, 
Is there like a convention or something? Oh. This is great. <laughs> Bandits. You know what we got here? Reese, do the We got a couple Hyperion warmongers, gentlemen. The bot. The vet. Prime it. <sighs> Already? Really? Just <laughs> give, give me the menu. Okay, but don't go bananas. These things ain't cheap. And do you know what we do with warmongers? Do you know what we do? Should we tell them what we do? Motor bot deployed. Time to clock in. <laughs> Listen, boys. You're gonna hand over that case. Or you're handing over your heads. Your choice. Look, guys, let's talk about this. Alright. Nice gun you got there. Wow. Got quiet all of a sudden. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, don't tell me I'll be able to shoot it. Engaging target. See? Oh. Piece of cake. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Yeah. oh. Can it protect you from this? I don't think so. You next to the boy? These cost so much. Thank you kindly. Wait, 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 wait! wait. Uh, Loaderbot, go get the car. Stop, thieves! Why wouldn't there be the big guy? <laughs> wanna... Alright. Come on. There's gotta be something. Anything? 
nothing. There it is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill. Kill him or grill him. What Kill him and grill him. What the hell should I know? Your freaking bot tossed us both out. Now kindly stand still and die. Nah, I'm good, fam. You liked that, didn't you? Hey! That's all I wanted to know. We could have avoided all of this. Ow! Get your ass gone! Okay, okay, okay. Loader bot? Put the car down. Sure thing. Oh, it's, it's, yeah. Please do something. Weapon subsystem requires your attention. All right, we'll have to improvise. Time to get funky. Wait, what? Power, power. Oh, yes, please. The metal is willing, but the spirit is weak. Come on, Reese, just tell it to run. Self-destruct option. Ow. Good night, sweet princess of. I kind of told it to evade, I but I didn't my first want to. Born, loader. Nah, I'm gonna name it Steve. Oh, you know, pro probably not. But. I, I can't believe we're alive. I mean, I, I never want to see somebody's brains come out of their nose. Not ever again. That, that was the single scariest experience of, of my entire life. Which should probably be over by now. But it's not. For some reason. But for those guys, a lot of those guys... Look, they got what they deserve. They attacked us. Maybe next time they'll think twice before... They're not thinking anything. I told you, I saw their brains. Yeah, I heard you. All right, let's just find this guy, August. Buy the key. Wow. Get the hell out of here. Oh, that's cool. It's all the little thing. The people you had to fight in Borderlands. That's cool. Oh, I remember this. I don't remember the skeleton. What are you, huh? What are you looking at? Yes, what the? Oh, bully mong! Ah, uh, uh, these are my favorite. Every animal on this planet have to look like a giant monster. Ah, uh, these were my favorite ones. Hey. hey. You know, the stuffed animals was one thing, but this is taking a turn I really don't want it to. Right this way to the world famous hall of Pandoran luminaries. 
Come face to face with icons of the planet's turbulent history and hear how each met their grisly fate. Please watch your step and marvel at some of the unexpected ends of life's grand design. There's nowhere else to go. Come on, let's just get through it. This is most likely a trap.